This is a public service announcement from Klebco, maker of the Bomberbot. Get your Bomberbot today. Oh, I thought I would make a, a quick public service announcement for those who are trying to edit uh, in this window here. Now, if you're already using Notepad or some Windows program to edit your large programs and you're not using this window, then you can probably stop watching. But if you're doing all your editing in these little screens here, you might want to listen to the rest of this because it's really going to save you a lot of time and effort. Because what you can do is, uh, if you're using Windows, you're going to go to the Start icon in the lower left-hand corner. And once you click on that start icon, you should have a little search box that you can type something into. And in that search box, go ahead and type in uh, app data with these uh, percent sign, app data percent sign. And it's going to bring open a folder for you. And inside that folder, you should find either Minecraft, if you uh, modded Minecraft, or Technic Launcher, which is actually what I have, Technic Launcher. And inside that folder, you're going to have, depending on which dropdown you use, you're going to have either Technic, uh, uh, SSP, or you're going to have Techit. Now I have, uh, I use Techit, so you're going to go ahead and go into that folder, and inside that folder, there is going to be another folder called Save or Saves, and inside that one, you're going to look for the name of your world. So this, depending on your world, mine is Techit with a capital with an exclamation point, uh, but yours is whatever you whatever you named your world when you created it. Now inside that, there's a magical folder called Computer. I think Computers, Computer, something like that. And inside that folder is hundreds, possibly. I don't know how many computers you have, but I have 200 and some. And uh, you have one through 200, and in my case, 204 computers. In your case, if you have three computers, you'll have one, two, and three. And you can see pretty easily which computer you have. If you go to your computer and you just type in ID, it'll tell you 204. Now, if you want to edit a file here on computer number 204, all you do is double-click on 204, and you'll see whatever files you have here. ROM doesn't count, but uh, you'll see sign as an example. And you can just double-click uh, or right click and then open with notepad or drag it into some other external editor and you can edit it from Windows itself so it's such a nice way if you've got a big program if you want to copy and paste a lot of stuff in into a program instead of typing it into this little window bit by bit by bit you can just copy and paste it all into that notepad it saves you a lot of time so hopefully that'll help you out as you maybe copy and paste some some other ideas uh, and, and work with those. It'll hopefully save you a lot of time. I hope that it does. And until next time, I hope you enjoy the rest of the series. And until next time, happy computing.